All right. Next on our list is going to be SRT. And within SRT, you have three options. You can use microphone, which is going to be the toughest. You have the built-in files, which is what we recommend. And if you have your own specific CD, you can use that as well. Go to word list here. Under auditory tests, you have your spondy word list A and B or child spondy word list. All you have to do is hit start. And on the right hand side, you've got your word list here. Your SRT start level right now is at 35, and that is because the SRT option is set to PTA. And in the bottom left hand side, it says PTA right is 35 dB. To start this, you're going to hit play, and it's going to say the word playground. You're going to hit the happier smiley face or correct or incorrect, and it's going to score everything here for you. And then you'll make your adjustment. So they got that correct. You make your change. And then you'll hit the next button or the next chevrons here. And it's going to say the word daybreak. They got that one incorrect. You'll hit incorrect here. Make your adjustment. And then hit the next arrow. Northwest they got that one correct. There is another way that you can do this. Go to options. You can go to advanced. And then at the bottom here, we have auto advanced words and SRT. If we select that and hit OK, the next word is mushroom. So what auto advanced words and SRT does is once you hit correct or incorrect, it's going to automatically go to the next word. So you would actually, if they got this one incorrect, you have to make your change and then hit incorrect. And then it's going to go to the next word. So depending on your preference, you'll just have to really play with it. Looking at the graph here, the vertical is going to be your score and percentage, 100%. And then the horizontal red line is your 50% line. If you want your SRT to show up on the printout, you have to be at a 50% or above for that particular dB level. So if I were to hit incorrect and it's below 50%, it's not going to show up on your score on the printout. So it has to be at 50% or above. If you want to print this off, you can go to the view button here. And it's going to pull up the word list, what you got correct and incorrect. It's also going to give you um, your DB level and scoring. If for some reason you selected a wrong list, you, you selected child spawn D word list or W22, you can always go to load here and it's going to pull up the word list again. Below load, you have stop. If you select stop, it's going to stop the test. If you do any type of masking for SRT, it's the same process as under audiometry. You select that, masking is turned on. You have your scoring 50%, four total words, two correct, two incorrect, and then all of your controls at the bottom are the same.